The rock and roll DJ was born in the 1950s in Nashville, Memphis, and Cleveland. All these cities had stations with powerful AM transmitters with signals that could reach dozens and dozens of states and even up into Canada. They also devoted portions of their broadcast day to playing what was called race records. These were rhythm and blues records by black artists, exciting new music that was devoured by white kids looking for something forbidden or at the very least something that their parents found awful. There was Dewey Phillips at WHBQ and WDIA in Memphis, Gene Nobles at WLAC in Nashville, and of course, Alan Freed, first from WJW in Cleveland and then WINS in New York. These guys, and they were almost exclusively guys, were a new breed of entertainer and cultural curator. They told the kids what was good, what was hot, how to talk, how to dress, what records to buy, what shows to see. They were the spreaders of the gospel of this new thing called rock and roll. 